Face-off win for Hampton Roads. Shot from right point, goes in! That's a power play goal, and Thomas McGuire says, come here, boys, that was mine. Hampton Roads Whalers with the one nothing lead. 10 minutes, 37 seconds into the first period. Anthony Moran brings us in for Utica. Played in front from the wing. Hampton Roads gets it out. And now it is Josh Kalinowski in his own zone. Kalinowski passes. Tyler Nicely lets it go off the stick for John Gutt. Gutt in for Utica. John Gutt passes the front. Tyler Nicely, he scores! And this game is tied on the... Set up too nicely from Gutt. Kalinowski's ripped from downtown. Knocked down in front. And uh, Hampton Roads tried to clear, but uh, this is even better for them. It didn't go down. Then they got another crack, and it's going to be Brady Missler, and won't get the roots of the net. Then Josh Kalinowski wedges him off, but then it goes back for the hard shot in on goal. Save is made by Trent Clark on Noah Henry. We've seen a lot of that here in this one. Cautious play for the most part. Physical, not a lot of sloppy turnovers. Uh, and uh, this is a good pass, and this is Watson moving in. Oh, and the save is made by Clark, denying Kyle Watson. Trip Clark with a great save there. I certainly thought Watson had him beat. Face-off win for the Whalers in the offensive zone. Thomas McGuire shoots, knocked down in front. Save is made by Trip Clark, and maybe a rebound too from Brady Missler. Power play for uh, another 15 seconds. Jake Kaplan will give it to Brady Missler. Back to Kaplan, and that's a shot low on Trip Clark, who makes at least one, maybe two saves. Uh, dump in for hey, Utica. Hampton Roads goaltender Rodriguez will play to the near corner. Now this is taken back by Utica, and it's going to be a backhander in front. Christian Sapani, the save is made by Rodriguez by this one Utica skater, one versus four. Got pulled a little bit, and Rodriguez is going to be able to play it after that entry from Donovan Jacobson. Jake Kaplan the other way for Hampton Roads. Dropped it. Shot, and it's going to roll for the chance in front. Save was made. Kyle Watson with nobody to look at in a Utica jersey except for the goaltender. Trev Clark makes another save. Goal stick play to the far side, but then it's pumped Back deep again. Mark Strazazar had it go to him. Drew in Christian Supani and then played it. And now it's going to be uh, gotten back by Hampton Roads. It's going to be a backhander by DJ Randall that misses. And it's Tyler Nicely out to neutral for Utica. And uh, with the delayed offside, they couldn't get that timing play. Good. Strazazar the other way for Hampton Roads. Scores! Jim Charlie Lollipop! Strazazar! With the great effort. And Hampton Roads leads 2-1 with 13.07 to go in the third period. Sending it back in for Utica. And it's going to go back to the line. Drayson Medich uh, shot into traffic. And then it's going to go perfectly for the shot right on goal. And it's a save made for Rodriguez on that hard one that came in from Mike Herrera. Josh Kalinowski. Oh, move it along, far side and out. Utica player, uh, bench clamoring for a penalty. Jake Kaplan putting the hands up to say, I didn't do nothing. Here's Brower, passes in front, and that's a big save for Clark on Kaplan. From the Hampton Roads bench, this is gravy time for them. Valuable seconds tick off the clock for uh, Utica. Hey, guy, you just need a rest. A huge hit on Tyson Rohr from Daniel McGeever. 2-1 score. Anthony Morin passes. And Jeff Ransom will send it wide at the Hampton Roads net. And this is cleared by Hampton Roads. And this is... No icing. And that caused some chaos. And a pass out in front. And it's put in! That is unbelievable. DJ Randall scores. Utica thought they were getting the icing. Trip Clark had his hand up for the icing and then he had to jump into action. It wasn't enough. Face off to the right of 
Dominic Rodriguez, who's made 25 saves today for Hampton Roads. This is a face-off win for Utica. He's not going to make this one. It's a shot and a score. Kalinowski with the shot, and it looks like the deflection from Tyson Rohrer. Touched long, less than a half minute to go in the third. This pass goes to Rohrer. Rohrer gets it out to neutral, and that's kicked by Brower for Hampton Roads. And now it's going to be Supani. He's going to give it on over. And it's in the zone entry. It's going to be Mike Herrera blasting. It's blocked. Herrera gets to it again. Shoots less than 10 seconds to go. Rattles out the center and down into the Utica zone. That was the last chance for Utica. Four seconds left. John Gutt will bring it in. Oh, maybe uh, not. Uh, Utica was going to get one more chance. And they just run out of time. This one's over. Hampton Rhodes survives with the 3-2 win over Utica here in this USPHL playoff game.